Hey everyone, I'm Almar of AlmarsGuides.com, and in this video here, I'm going to explain to you where to get the Cloak of Balderon in Baldur's Gate 1, as well as the Helm of Balderon 2. So, technically both of these items are intertwined with a quest called Helm of Balderon, the Helm of Balderon, as you can see here. And it begins by talking to Degrodil, who's in this building right here, the southernmost building that I'm mousing around, Degrodil's house, in uh, Northwest Baldur's Gate. You can see we're in Northwest Baldur's Gate right here. So the Helm of Balderon is actually quite easy to get. You can get it from this building right here, the Helm and Cloak Inn. I will show you uh, where to get it. It's right up these stairs, the second staircase in the back of the Helm and Cloak Inn. And if you hold down tab, you can see we can interact with that painting over there in the, uh, in the corner. The painting is trapped, which is why I haven't run over there and interacted with it just yet. It will shoot a fireball at us when we interact with it, which it apparently is just... There we go. May as well eat the fireball, right? But the uh, the Helm of Balderon is right there. This is it. I'm not going to loot it right... Well, actually, I guess I can loot it right now to show you an idea. So there you go. Helm of Balderon, just like that. Arguably one of the best helms in the entire game. So now that we have that helm, we can dip. Now, let me show you how to get the Cloak of Balderon. So, in order to get the Cloak, you will need to uh, start the Helm of Balderon quest. Well, in order to get the Cloak without being um, killing an innocent person and losing the reputation. If you just want to uh, kill the innocent person and you don't care about the reputation loss, then skip ahead a little bit in the video. Uh, because when we go to the Underseller, I will explain that po portion. So in here is where we have a few people. All of these people, we have to free the uh, these restoration scrolls or uh, stone to flesh scrolls, I mean. And this will effectively, uh, this is part of the searching for the Helm of Balderon quest. So freeing these people, once you free them, you talk to them and each of them basically has uh, a unique little dialogue thing to say. Specifically, the person you need to talk to though is uh, the person up here. Right here. So what you have to do in dialogue with him is quite unique. Uh, you have to you have to do what I'm doing, basically. Give me a second. Here we go. You basically tell him that you're seeking the Helm of Balderon, and then you have to uh, play nice with him, basically. Tell him that you were hired to achieve it and tell him too that you uh, you don't mind letting him keep the helm. Because if you if you say that, then he'll give you basically the flag you need, I guess, for uh, talking to his prostitute in the underseller. See, there you go. And he tells you, he basically informs you of the, uh, the lady in the underseller who has the cloak of Balderon. So now we need to head to the Underseller. Enter the sewers and go to the Underseller. This is one of the entrances to the Underseller where I'm running my characters to. So we'll just zip on down there and head to the Underseller real fast. So now we are in the Underseller and my map's all skipping around. Let me explore the area. Just so I don't waste your time running around here for the video. And Quinash is the person we're looking for. And she's in this room right here just off the central uh, circular big room thing. Quinash right there. So you have two options. Uh, one, you can do the dialogue correctly with her. So if you approach her, you should say Val sent me to give the cloak. And she asks you basically to describe what he looks like. You don't actually have to describe what he looks like. You just have to do the... Uh, Perhaps I cannot recall his features, but that changes nothing. He offered me the cloak for his uh, rescue, and I accepted. And then she basically tells you, uh, or she uh, gives you the cloak. And then you can ask her where the helm is as well. And she'll tell you where the helm is, but we really don't need that information because we already found the helm. So there we go. She gives you the cloak. Now, of course, if she doesn't give you the cloak, the alternative is to just kill her and loot the cloak off of her corpse or pickpocket her and then loot the cloak. And either way, you can get it from Quinash in the Underseller. 
So that really is all there is to it. I hope this video helped you guys out. I hope it answered your questions. If I left anything out, got anything wrong, please let me know in the comment section below. And uh, leave me a like if this video did help you out. Aside from that, I will catch you guys around in future Baldur's Gate 1 videos. Peace.